It's great to be talking to you from Birmingham today and, and, and not my home back in Cheshire. Um, I've walked around the city today, there's an air of vibrancy that wasn't here last week. You know, it's been an interesting few months, hasn't it? It's been challenging, but it's also given me time to reflect on what comes next, reflect on the importance of workspace. And I've heard a lot, and I think we've all read and heard a lot about, you know, is the office dead? Is the office obsolete? Can we all work from home in the future? Uh, and to be quite frank, I think it's absolute nonsense. You've got to bring people together. And the best environment in which to do that clearly is a home. And that home for any organisation is its office. We want to work for organisations that engage us, where we're learning, where we're developing. I'm not sure how you do that if you don't have a home. How do you drive culture? How do you drive values? There's an opportunity to rethink about how we use our offices. And it's a great, you know, working for an organisation like Bruntwood, we're at the forefront of that. I don't miss the commute. Who misses the commute? And I don't ever see myself going back to the way I used to work. There's a real opportunity here to allow individuals within organisations to choose how they deliver productivity for themselves that works for them, but also works for the organisation. Profit is a means to an end, but it can't be our end goal. So we have to put our people at the heart of the decisions that we're going to make. And I suspect there are many organisations out there thinking, oh, this is a great opportunity to reduce our costs. How are they going to attract, develop and retain talent? Those organisations that put people at the heart of their decision making, they'll be investing further and deeper into their workspace and creating fantastic environments in which to develop great ideas and develop great talent. And those are the organisations that the young talent coming out of schools and universities will choose to navigate to. And I want to be part of that, and I know Brunt would want to be part of that. We want to create spaces where individuals will be able to thrive. Organisations, our customers thrive. Our cities once again thrive. Our nation, ultimately, will be able to thrive.